Hi Taurus, the Awakened Dreamer here to give you your monthly money and career tarot reading for the month of June 2022. Thank you so much for joining me. Do keep in mind this is general for your month, so just take what resonates. But as well, I want to thank you in advance for your love and support uh, in the form of likes for this video, comments down below, um, and uh, subscriptions to this channel if you haven't done so already. Definitely join this strong Taurus tribe. And as well, to book a personal reading with myself, just reach out via email. Everything you need lies down below in the description box. I'll definitely get that started for you as they were always accurate. If I even said that correctly, as they are always accurate. Um, don't be afraid to repeat and or correct oneself if you slip up throughout the month. Uh, but you will be doing a lot of speaking. I can say that right off the bat. Um, storytelling, explaining, inspiring, sharing. Um, achieving a lot. Taurus is on a roll. But um, we're going to begin and pull some messages from the Soul's Journey deck and then further speak upon your money and career for the month with the um, Light Sears deck and then finish off this lovely reading with some Making Magic cards, the small deck. So let's begin. They're saying a little bit feisty. You can do a lot, so do it. Okay. Multitasking, I feel the need to say prioritizing. Uh, you could be working a business, running a business, working a job, uh, running from one to the next, accomplishing a lot. Um, some days will be work uh, from beginning till end, right? Other days will just be a little bit less or just a lot less. You could find yourself working one job and it feeling heavier than it should at times, but you have a lot coming towards you obligation wise. Some of you working two jobs, three jobs, Taurus taking on a lot at this time. Um, you could find that financial obligations are on the mind all the meanwhile. Thinking about future endeavors, future goals, wanting more money and it flowing in as it should. Okay, more to come in the upcoming months, but I do expect uh, a level of travel for the majority of Taurus is drawn to this reading. Okay, if you were planning on or thinking about a trip to a different state, county, uh, country, something of the sort, um, it could be a lot closer than some of the other Tauruses, but for some it's to get a, acquire a new move of residence. For some it's for business. Um, this is a lot before I even pull an oracle, but I truly feel as if um, in the midst of being pushed to a reminder to discipline oneself to accomplish what you need to, having a lot going on, right? Especially if you run a business, even running errands, small things. I truly do see, once again, Taurus taking a trip and acquiring what you need to get it Taurus get it I feel like it's gonna be so satisfying and um, more relaxing than you might expect it to be based on the past uh, when it comes to accomplishments and travel okay as I catch my breath um, I feel as if a level of doubt from the past is being wiped away uh, as you start to um, rake in the money right the money starts to flow in rapidly the achievements come to be people recognize you through your business or through your work or both for how talented you truly are but there's a focus all the meanwhile on your individual purpose okay I know what I'm here to do it feels quite um, stern and uh, honest right helpful it feels as if you just are succeeding after um, a long time coming right I, I do see a lot of Tauruses drawn to this reading who have put a lot of effort uh, consistently towards a business getting it off the ground or even a job right a field if you will um, and starting to see the rewards reaping the rewards of all of that effort um, even if you receive some of which previous to this month it just feels as if you're doing a lot better a warm feeling about the month okay as I split the deck to success okay you're succeeding left and right achieving money once again uh, clientele customers flowing in you are seeing your goals start to feel more doable as one big one starts to uh, come to be okay or, or just gets checked off your to-do list and you can breathe a little bit more it feels very tied into the month of September um, or for some of you it starts in June okay um, I'm being shown a key okay somebody's acquiring a key to where they're meant to be love it Gotta love when spirit rhymes. 
I, I do sense a level of uh, your mood varying throughout the month. Okay, I will say that where you're very stern, very serious, very um, a little, they're saying uptight, you know, just getting done what you need to very mature and methodical about analytical about what you're doing, what you need to achieve, right? Um, people respecting that to a certain extent. Then there's the humorous side of you, okay? I was pushed to sing some made up, uh, they're saying funky songs before I started recording or reading. Um, I feel like you're bringing a lightness to a situation even if you don't think so. Sometimes you know so. Um, that's needed as other people are potentially overly, overly serious as we get the success card again. But I do sense that um, there are other times when you're just giddy, happy, running around doing what you need to do, balancing out multiple opportunities or just everything that's on your plate, but happy all the meanwhile. Even when you're really stern and uptight and very focused, there's a, a nice energy about you. You're healing people even if you don't think so, okay? I just got so satisfied with that. A level of empathy, okay, and worry in the air. I feel like there's people in your situation, wow, um, this is a lot, who are worried, okay? Whether it's about customers, clientele, that business, um, you name it. It just feels like there could be some worrisome clients or customers requesting your services or um, items throughout the month. But either way, it could be all of which that I just mentioned. I need to put yourself in somebody or multiple, multiple people's shoes to understand better what they're going through. Okay, and others who are worried, pay no mind. Okay, just do your job. Uh, get done what you need to. Um, allow for oneself to recognize that there will be some spiritual occurrences throughout the month. Don't let it get the best of you. Okay, four purple cards, my friend, talking about all of the royalty that you exude um, throughout the month and um, spirituality once again. Okay, let's move on to this abundance, okay? Um, getting all of the best cards in this deck for a money and career read. Tauruses are experiencing a level of, as I saw the number 711 on the timestamp, the abundance you deserve, okay? You seeing doors open for oneself, right? Going back to that key, but other doors that don't entail an actual key, right? Opportunities, money flowing in, because abundance isn't just money, uh, to remind you. I'm being drawn to I'm a limitless being, okay? I am a limitless being, and you can manifest whatever you desire in this physical reality, and you're reminding oneself and other people of just that, and doing it with ease, but showing I'm not afraid to put in the hard work and effort all the meanwhile. I'm a Taurus, hear me roar. You might have fire in your chart, okay? Um, we're keeping that out <sighs> twice now, Taurus, you're getting success. Okay. Um, you're one of the most positive readings thus far, but I feel it speaks a lot about your energy, your mood, right? Once again, your motivation, your desire, your ease of achieving what you need to, that's going to impress people. They're going to see you as somebody who just gets it done and helps other people and all the meanwhile in your spare time or just in general through your work and that's that, right? Um, move out of my way, I need to make some money, but doing it politely. Does that make sense? Um, I know that there is no greater goal than to love, okay? There's a level of love exuding from the work you're providing, um, presenting, creating throughout this month of June, okay? July and August will be even more fruitful. I feel the need to say more abundant but acceptance being the last of the oracles before we move on to the tarot. I'm learning to accept the things that I cannot change. I really feel as if this is a month where it's a turning point towards you accepting, as I see the Queen of Cups in this deck, where her hands are held up high like this, like if I can't change it, I won't, right? Um, letting go of situations, accepting that moving forward, a work situation, a living situation, maybe both is temporary, okay? Not everything's meant to be with you in the long run. I feel as if you are making it concrete, sure that you can upgrade in the next couple months or in general. You will find that there are situations, if you have a day-to-day -day job, right, where there's some people who work in an annoying manner right around you, or again, a level of worry or just complications, right? Sticking to your own work or can, kind of staying in your own world, your own Taurus world. 
um, sorting through as they feel like you have a lot in your mind and are busy all the meanwhile and accepting what you can't change and just putting your hands up and saying, not gonna get my hands dirty, right? If I don't really have to, not going to overcomplicate myself or wrap myself up with drama and uh, over uh, complicating my work day, my work week, my month, right? Keeping your mind on your uh, goals and your money, being very much tied up to each other uh, and succeeding all the meanwhile. Damn, just damn. What a good beginning. Let's continue and pull some tarot. Let me put these in the right order. Okay, I heard abundance to success. Okay. There's also a vibe about you. Bear with me as you're getting ready to shake things up as the camera does shake a bit. Um, I feel like there are times when you're rushing around doing what you need to, but then there are other times where you just are reminding people I do get a little bit frustrated, but I get over it real quick. Um, and I don't feel the need to rush for you. Okay. I will prioritize and accomplish what I need, need to. It feels like you're reminding oneself and maybe even explaining to other people simplistically. I used to be that stressful employee or business owner or just individual in general, more anxious in my past. Even if some of that still is present for you specifically individually. I'm not going to rewind back to being ultra stressful, right? Or ultra stressed out in the midst of accomplishing what I need to, getting a job done or multiple jobs, um, just because others are more of that kind of worker, okay? Do it your way and get it done and impress all the meanwhile. And you'll finish your day feeling burnt out, I feel the need to say, but not overly stressed as others will be. I just heard you are you and we are we. Okay, interesting. You may feel very disconnected from uh, a work crowd, right? People who you work with, it's fine. Um, I really do think it's going to work to your advantage, okay, as the wheel turns for you. People feeling very connected to each other and you may at times feel connected to them, but it's almost as if you're not meant to feel very tied down or tied up with certain individuals in a work environment. While you could find another situation more business oriented, you're very connected to um, the community you've built in a sense, okay? Um, what you feel connected to, who you feel connected to throughout the month, even uh, as far as accomplishing goals, all purposeful, okay? Trust in that. With the Queen of Swords being at the center of your reading, thinking about what needs to be cut out, right? Being a bit stern at times once again, ready to defend, ready to accomplish, and just um, making it happen for oneself. We'll just leave that at that. As your world's changing and you are too. There are moments of peace um, and serenity that you're given throughout the month. They're very rare, but you're able to um, catch your breath, okay? Maintain that healthy glow. It feels like you may uh, want to take care of oneself more than you can do to the amount of work you have to accomplish but feeling as if um, you're ready to start fresh in however that works for you, move a residence, financial investment, job, you name it. But with the world and the death and rebirth card, your world's changing, my friend, and it's beautiful, okay? You're feeling as if people are seeing you as somebody who's desiring completion and elevating all the meanwhile, changing and growing and glowing um, in the midst of all you're accomplishing, okay? Um, I do feel very drawn to this infinity symbol here. The possibilities are endless for you at this time, and it's quite evident to those around you, okay? Um, you may feel as if certain people want to keep you in a situation longer than you know intuitively. Um, is It just feels like it has an, an inevitable, inevitable, excuse me, ending, as um, it feels like certain energies in that situation make you a bit nervous. Um, I'm hearing, I'm so glad I didn't re-sign that lease, but with the magician here, yet again, another infinity symbol, change is a must and you're manifesting it for the benefit of your future, okay? Um, some of you entailing sunnier weather or just more peace in your situation, okay? Um, less is more is now what I'm getting in regards to efforts to manifest, okay? In certain ways, in other ways, the... Uh, efforts you're putting forth are helping you make money and and whatnot succeed but it feels like as well 
when it comes to speaking, you can hear I'm over ranting, right? The messages are coming out as spirit speaks through me as they should be. You know, everything happens for a reason in these readings, but I do feel as if you're pushed to recognize that you don't need to overshare in the work environment to employees, to customers, boss figures of, of authority, you name it, okay? Even to clientele who you're helping or supporting in one way, shape or form, um, supplying is what I'm hearing. But either way, simplify, okay? Think before you speak, but sometimes spirit will speak through you for those, especially those very spiritually connected like myself. There's only so much you can do, but you're manifesting a lot and that's drawing in an immense amount of attention, okay? People seeing you as somebody who's going places and you definitely are, okay? Let the money roll on in, okay? Said that really weird and I don't care. Feeling very confident throughout the month, especially towards the second half, um, knowing that you are just switching things up in the near future. Being viewed as somebody who's very wise, very mature for their age, very experienced in a field they're working, right? A craft, being looked to as somebody who is somewhat of a master at this point on, of what they do. Um, uh, somebody, a lot of people are in awe, I feel the need to say. You're very much watched by an authority figure, multiple, spirit, you name it. Um, you could be working on an online platform and that giving you a level of viral attention or just um, numbers increasing, analytics increasing, people watching your content, sharing it with their friends, family, uh, coworkers, you name it. Some even, even sharing it on their own social media and that helping you increase and potentially help others and, and or make money, okay? You can help people and still uh, help oneself. Does that make sense? You'll get that reminder if need be, but I do feel like you're very wise and um, people see that about you, okay? We have the King and Queen of Swords here. I feel the need to um, take. I was just drawn to say you're manifesting a ton of success if I didn't already say that. And I do feel like you are exuding a level of love for your future. It feels like things are finally about to fall into place, um, but not just yet fully, right? Uh, but the financial increase, to say the very least, the increase in analytics numbers, a success in that manner, um, is helping you feel hopeful about the future, okay? Just gotta get to the end of a situation or multiple and see oneself soar to new heights. Let's keep pulling. With the King of Pentacles, this is truly meant to as it lies on to the, or falls onto the Abundance card. You're pushed to recognize that, yeah, at times you're burnt out, but you're getting to where you need to go. You're doing what you need to do. And again, people are impressed all the meanwhile. This does typically come through as a manifestation card for me as a reader, but the work you're presenting, right? The ways you're making money, impressing people, people seeing you again as somebody who's just a shining star and it, there's just this level of confidence in what you're doing at this point, regardless of how long you've been working towards it or uh, perfecting that craft, that skill set or multiple. And I feel as if you're reminded you're protected in the midst of all of which. The bookcases in the back, uh, informing oneself through research, knowledge, learning more from spirit or just in general from others around you in regards to what you need to know for a job, a business, um, a move a residence, new financial investment, contracts will be signed for some. Um, do read them in, uh, in full, okay? Thoroughly know what you're putting your John Hancock on, okay? And the fact that I just said that in of itself, I do feel like you're pushed to recognize that your name is becoming something as the month trickles on, as even in more so in the upcoming months, okay? People are knowing who you are or getting to know who you are. Uh, beginning to recognize that you are somebody to look out for in this world, okay? As your own individual world transpires. Um, do let any fear, doubt, and anxiety um, be thrown up in the air as you get ready for a passionate fresh start and you lead oneself, work oneself to a level of abundance and success that's truly meant for you and only you. Get it, Taurus. Let's pull some Making Magic cards. for Taurus. 
Tree of Life, true wisdom and making good choices in life. Bear with me as I just was pushed to move my hand. Time to shine, creates the energetic resonance for golden opportunities. It is definitely a month where you're given multiple opportunities to shine and uh, show off, you know, to show people you, what you're made out of, what you are meant to accomplish in this lifetime, being definitely tied into your life purpose, your destiny, all the meanwhile. I did get um, cut off um, camera difficulties, but I have four more that came out for you talking about um, you achieving, winning the award, accolade, or contract. Did I not mention a contract or multiple for you? I feel as if people are recognizing you once again on a multitude of levels as you achieve a ton, if I didn't say that enough in this reading, and feeling as if people are seeing you as somebody who is just exuding a true level of confidence as you grow and change through your work and make the money that feels necessary for you, strutting around and your self-confidence helping um, shine through and uh, shine through your work to convey messages more confidently and uh, take your platform, your business, your job to the next level, okay? They're saying you're going places. As you're pushed to recognize that your wishes are coming true, rapid achievement of your dreams and wishes. Beautiful. Who doesn't want to hear that? Um, as things start to speed up for you on a multitude of levels. And to finish off, little luxuries generates luxurious experiences and surroundings. Make sure to treat yourself throughout the month as the money does roll in for oneself, as it will keep you feeling good, confident, and motivated towards all that you still have to achieve in the upcoming months. You are kicking ass this month, all right? So I hope this was truly helpful. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if you haven't done so already. Go out yourself an amazing month. I know you will, and I'll definitely see you next time. Bye, Taurus.